Hey there, collective of Scorpios. Welcome back for another love reading. This is going to be your secret crush. Who is secretly crushing on you, Scorpios? Shout out to all of the Scorpios of the world. Uh, I love each and every one of you. As you know, I am a Scorpio myself. So I can relate, okay? So we're tapping into the energy to see who is this person that is secretly crushing on you. How do they feel? How do they perceive you? And what is going on in their life, okay? Because sometimes secret crushes, <laughs> they're mad, they're angry. Sometimes they're loving. You may have somebody that's secretly crushing on you that's in love with you. You may have somebody that's secretly, secretly crushing on you that's uh, feeling rejected. So let's see. Spirit, show me the energy of the person that is secretly crushing on Scorpios. Spirit, who is this person that is secretly crushing on Scorpio? Scorpio, this is a general. It's not going to resonate for everyone, so only take the part that fits and discard the rest. Spirit, show me the energy for the person that is secretly crushing on Scorpios. Spirit, who is the person secretly crushing on Scorpios? Spirit, show me. Who is the person secretly crushing on Scorpios? the devil seven of cups we deal with the capricorn ace of cups another water sign cancel scorpio pisces all right spirit show me the energy for the person that is secretly crushing on scorpio who is the person secretly crushing on scorpio please subscribe to this channel like and share leave me a high vibrational comment let's see i see that high priestess here so somebody's keeping a secret here see the three of swords somebody may be in their feelings over you scorpio could be somebody here you already closed out a cycle with or a chapter with could be an aquarius see the star energy the moon could be fear Fantasies, dreams. There's <laughs> a lot going on with this person that is secretly crushing on you. Spirit, who is the person secretly crushing on Scorpio? All right. All right, Scorpio, let's see who is this person that is secretly crushing on Scorpios. Page of Pentacles, the overall energy. Ten of Wands. Four of Wands, Knight of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, The Sun, The Emperor, and The Two of Cups. And underneath the bottom of the deck here, you have mm, Ace of Pentacles, Three of Swords, Knight of Wands. So the person that's secretly crushing on you seems like somebody's trying to come back and make up for their their reckless behavior here. Could have been dealing with somebody here who didn't want nothing more than just fun. They may have not been looking for anything serious. Maybe they didn't bring much to the table but a good time. But after they've messed everything up, now it seems like they want to come back. Maybe somebody's finally standing up in their truth and in their power here. Mm. Let's see, Scorpios. Now, look, this is a soulmate. You could be dealing with the Leo here. So you have, you could be dealing with the Aries. You got Emperor and the Sun card as your majors. But like I say, could be a twin flame with the four of wands here. Now, either this person here, maybe this person is being illuminated here. Maybe Spirit is showing this person that maybe their actions may have pushed you away. Because almost like someone here may have, Maybe they did not come in and bring you something stable and solid or something meaningful. And maybe they made you feel left out here. So it's almost like your person's having a hard time doing that. See? Because you got the little bitty page of Pentacles. It's almost like, oh, let, let me go get this to Scorpio. So Scorpio will stop complaining. See to this. So it's almost like somebody was doing the bare minimums here. And, it, and this seemed like this was too much. Maybe someone felt like a relationship was too much of a burden on them at this time, so they wasn't able to give much. Mm. Ain't that something? The nerve, the nerve, the nerve. All right, let's see, Scorpio. You see that? You see how folks do you? 
They already showing up in the Knight of Wands, but they got them there to come in with a page of Pentacles too. They should, they should be coming with this Ace of Pentacles because they was in the Knight of Wands here. Mm -mm, they broke your heart, though, it seems like. And we must have been in a third-party situation here. Or in the Knight of Wands, no telling how many extra people there were. <laughs> uh, obviously, it's just a somebody here. And the Three of Swords could represent this Knight of Wands just not wanting a relationship. That's heartbreaking. See, it's almost like somebody like, God dang, you came in here, you got, see? Because they go to Seven of Swords. So I feel like your person closed out this chapter because I feel like your person feels like you rejected their love here. You rejected love, but you came in for the passion here because you were not honest. You were only out for what you wanted here. And I feel like your person wanted more. And, it, and it, like I said, it don't even have to be that it's a third party. It's just that their actions could have broke your heart here. But in this Knight of Wands, it could very well be a, another person involved because you got the Knight of Wands here. <clears throat> so let's see. So you have the Page of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, Ten of Wands, Four of Wands, and the Emperor in this Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries, and then the Sun card with the Aries, I mean with Leo. And then you have the Two of Cups, <laughs> Cancel, Scorpio, and Pisces. That's the only water you got in here is your sentimental love. <laughs> Oh, you ain't showed up as the queen of cups, the king of cups. You just stood in for what you represent. You say, look here. All I know is that I am here for you. I am here as a partnership. Okay? We share a soulmate connection. Maybe someone... Maybe, maybe you are in love with this person with this two of cups or maybe you're not acknowledging it. Maybe you feel like you ain't got time to settle down right now. So let's see. Now I could represent what well, this is them, Scorpio. Let me see. Just clarify. Let the cards let the cards speak for themselves. So let's start off with this little old bitty page pen cup. And this is some good news. This is some good news, it is, but I mean it's it's the beginning stage. It's a small offer, but this is this is the big kahuna right here. So let's see. Spirit, who is the person secretly crushing on Scorpio in this five of, excuse me, in this page of pentacles? Why is the page of pentacles here for the person secretly crushing on Scorpio? Spirit, clarify. Why is the page of pentacles here? Page of pentacles. The high priestess here. Mm. So either your person is a Pisces or your person is hiding something. Just seen the Ace of Pentacles. The Queen of Swords could be dealing with the air sign. All right, Spirit, who is this person secretly crushing on Scorpio with this Page of Pentacles and High Priestess? Mm. The Tower here. Something is coming out, or something is, or some, or maybe something is about to surprise you here, because they go to Ace of Cups and the Moon card, and they go to King of Wands. You could be dealing with the fire sign here. So this is your person. I feel like your person is not letting you know. I feel like your person is keeping secrets. Your person don't want you to know this, because I feel like you've already ended things. But what your person? What you don't know, because see, like they go to moon card. You got the moon card and the high priestess mixed with the tower card, which is your energy. And you got the ace of cups. It's almost like somebody's coming in here to offer you something. It ain't much, but like I feel like it's just to, it's like an icebreaker. I feel like more will come, perhaps, because I, like I said, I see the ace of pentacles here. But this is your secret crush of somebody here who's not, is not talking that they're hiding something. They're hiding the fact that they don't, that they, I feel like this person wants to surprise you, okay? Because this is what this tower card represents. Because you probably don't see it coming because you've already closed out a chapter with this person. But behind the scenes, they're plotting to come back. So this may be why it's a burden here is because maybe they did you wrong. 
That's the route. You got the three of swords here. So it's almost like somebody here secretly crushing on you. In the background, they're not revealing this because they know that they did some foul stuff to you. See? See, they're going to, uh, once again, they know you ended things with them because you, they probably rejected your love because they wasn't looking for no love. See, they was too busy out here like this. And I feel like this broke your heart because you was wanting something better from this person. Because once again, I feel like you're in love with this person and I feel like you wanted more and they probably wasn't ready for it. So now you have the Ten of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. Spirit, what's up with the person secretly crushing on Scorpio in this Ten of Wands energy? Clarify the Ten of Wands. Ten of Wands. Page of Cups. They got a little bitty page of cups again. Who had this? This sounds familiar here. Three of cups, five of pentacles in reverse, two of wands. For somebody, it's almost like this person want to come in and do the bare minimum just to get back in your good grace, y'all. That's what I feel like. And I feel like this is too much for them, the ten of wands. Someone don't want to work too hard for you, Scorpio, is what I feel like. Okay? They feel like it's just too goddamn much. They're like, I ain't got to do that for the rest of them. Why? why who are you? <laughs> Maybe that's... Oh, there was an other reading. I feel like somebody feels like you just too much. Why you... <laughs> why you got to make it so hard on me? Why don't you just let me do what I want to do? But I feel like you're not going for it. And somebody's feeling like, God dang, all I want to do is just hang out and have some fun. I don't want all of that. See, it's like somebody's coming in here. Now, for some of y'all, like I say, it's a burden. Could be a burden on this person uh, because you have closed out a chapter in this person here. Uh, but it could represent this person want to come in and apologize because they want to re reconcile and hang out with you. That's the three of cups. So for some of y'all, this person is a burden because they know how they did you and they're going to have to, it's almost like they got to eat their words. They got to eat their words is what I feel like here. Because see somebody don't like, you got the five of pentacles on the table in the upright, but underneath the bottom, you got the five of pentacles again in the reverse. So it's feel like this person could have made you feel left out and I feel like you had to close out a chapter because you realize this person wasn't going to bring you nothing stable and solid. So now they may be feeling left out now because it's a burden to even have to come back because I feel like you're making it too hard for them, but I feel like you should. It's like they want it to be easy, but you're not an easy person. You want fair and you want, that's, that's why you had the justice. Was this for you? I've been getting it mixed up and doing so many readings. Thought I saw the justice card here. All right, Spirit, give one more card for this person that is secretly crushing on Scorpio with this Ten of Wands. What is this about? Ten of Wands. Page of Cups, Three of Cups. Mm. Queen of Wands, see? Because this person still is not looking at you from an emotional perspective. They're looking at you, someone here, like they can go and have fun with, see? So it's almost like this person going to come in here for some of y'all. This person want to come in here and try to butter you up, play on your emotions, apologize, or give very little emotionally because they just want to re reconcile with this type of energy. They just want to have fun with you again. They still ain't looking for nothing. And like I say, it's a burden for this person because you're making them do too much. They feel like, why should they have to do all of this? Or, or, or maybe it's just, it's almost like, I feel like Scorpio, it's almost like here. You're making somebody up their game if they want you and they're not used to it, okay? Somebody's used to not playing by the rules, but when they met you, you're forcing them to acknowledge your worth here and you ain't playing with them, okay? And I feel like this is a burden to them because they want you, but in order to get you, they're going to have to play they're going to have to play it by your rules. So now you got the four of wands. Spirit, what's up with the uh the person who is secretly crushing on Scorpio in this four of wands? Feel like you want more, see? <laughs> Snap, 
snap, snap, snap, snap. God dang. <laughs> they said, well, why you can't be like everybody else? <laughs> See, because in your mind, you like, uh-uh, but, but this this is their energy. They already know. <laughs> it's almost like they said, God dang, messing with Scorpio, you can't just milk that cow, man. No, you got to buy the whole God dang me cow. You can't, Scorpio can't be milked. You got to, you got to, <laughs> they say, if you mess with Scorpio, y'all go together. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, snap, snap, snap. See, Ace of Pentacles, like I say, y'all not playing no games with them. And they're not used to, somebody's not used to somebody standing up for themselves. And I feel like you told this person, if you, if you want the honey, then you better come right then. See, you, you say, look, no, <laughs> you say, I know you want the honey, but where is uh, the money? Where, 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 where is, where, where is the, uh, the investment towards something stable, towards a relationship? This is what you're saying. You said, look, I already know what you want, but you got to come in with something better because this is real over here. Now, if you want the best of me, you better you better up your game. And I feel like you ain't playing no games. And like I say, somebody somebody shaking their head like that goddamn Scorpio. Because Scorpio ain't playing no games. See, it's almost like somebody has to play your way if they want you. And they're not used to this. Somebody is used to roaming around the streets in this Knight of Wands, Seven of Swords energy, doing whatever they want to do, but they done messed around. And I feel like they done caught feelings for you too. And now you're not, you're in control of your life. And now they got to play by your rules or at least do it correctly. Stop trying to get over. So now you got the Knight of Pentacles. Spirit, what's up with this Knight of Pentacles for the person secretly crushing on Scorpio? Clarify the Knight of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Knight of Pentacles. Mm. <laughs> King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. See that this is someone here who takes their time. Could be dealing with the air sign here. See how they've been taking their time? They've been taking their time when it comes to something real, but you see how they're moving over here when it comes to other things. See? And all they're doing is causing heartbreak in here with their deception. They quit to move in when it comes to the pleasure because you showed up in the Knight of Wands, uh, the Queen of Wands. But when it comes to offering something stable and solid for this Four of Wands, they got to think about it. I, I got to pray about it. <laughs> you ever go to somebody in need and they tell you they got to pray about it, that means they ain't going to do it. There's somebody saying that they take it so long, they got to pray about it. See how they take their time about something real? <laughs> could be a Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. Spirit, what's up? This, the person secretly crushing on Scorpio with this Knight of Pentacles. What's up? See? 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 See there? They've been taking their time, but something is about to change. See there? They go to Wheel of Fortune. Because I feel like this person really is in love with you, Scorpio. I feel like whoever your secret crush is, I feel like they're really in love with you. But I feel like this person has probably been dealing with people who don't question them, who get along, who probably like them. But I feel like you call somebody here, to you making sure they, they're be held, held accountable here. See? You got the Hierophant and the Seven of Pentacles here. See? See, 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 because you letting them know that you know your God dang me worth here. See, that's why you got the emperor here. Could be dealing with the Libra or Aries. But see, this is you and this emperor's energy. You letting somebody know you can't treat me like everybody else, God dang it. I am marriage material. I don't know what you thought. See? See there? See, see, see? <laughs> Oh, snap. Somebody thought somebody had it wrong, god dang it. I thought something about Scorpio. You seem like you a game changer. Somebody say you the game changer, god dang it. Now you got the five of pentacles. Spirit, what's up with the Scorpio secret crush in this five of pentacles? Clarify the five of pentacles. Five of pentacles, eight of swords here. I feel like they're feeling this kind of way now because they're not getting what they want and you done shut down. See, you done wounded them. You done brought somebody down to their knees. See, this person ain't never met nobody like you, Scorpio. Whoever your secret crush is, it's almost like somebody thought they were going to make you conform to their uh, unhealthy lifestyle. But you're like, boy, <laughs> little boy, what? <laughs> 
See there, you done brought somebody to their knees now, Scorpios. Two of swords in the reverse. I feel like this person ain't going to be uh, not, not knowing what to do now. You see, this person finna know what to do now. Two of swords in the reverse and the lover's card. Could be dealing with the Gemini. Got air energy in here. See, you call somebody to have to go within on this. Could be a Virgo. See, you, you done affected somebody here. Because here's somebody here who felt like they didn't have to do what you say. They ain't got to do this. They can live their life like they want to and just string you along and break your heart. But you had to show them that they, this this was this is how they're looking at this. They, they say, God dang, Scorpio, you done changed the MNF and game. You done changed the games. Hashtag Scorpio the game changer. So now you have the sun card, Leo energy. You got a lot of majors in here, honey. You got the tower, the high priestess. The Will of Fortune, The Lovers, The Sun Card, The Emperor. I seen The Empress. So now you got The Sun Card, Virgo Energy. All right, Spirit, what is, who is the person secretly crushing on Scorpio with The Sun Energy? Five of Wands. I feel like this person, once again, once again, this person may have had so many people pursuing them that they they let it go to their head and they thought that they could do whatever they want to do. But spirit had to show them. Spirit had to show somebody about you, Scorpio. Or maybe you gave them a reality check. Maybe you had to enlighten them with this Queen of Swords energy. Because you got the Sun card, Five of Wands. There it is again. The Hierophant and the freaking Empress. See? It's like whatever they thought they knew, this person, it's, it's, it's almost like spirit is showing this person, you can't, how, how can you have this in competition? This is who you settle down with. But someone has had inner conflict and so used to people fighting for their attention here that they lost focus of what was really valuable to them. And they tried to put you in a category with everybody else. But spirit said, uh-uh, you can't do this one like that, partner. You, instead of trying to put Scorpio down, won't you uh, uh, level up? I feel like this is what Spirit is telling them. Won't you level up here? And maybe this is what they're doing. See? I feel like somebody lived a reckless life. They could do what they want to do until they met you and you the freaking game changer. All right, Spirit, the Emperor could be dealing with the Aries or Libra or Taurus, Gemini. See, because they in love, which is just that they, they don't want. It's almost like I can be in love with you and still trick off too. It's like, I, well, what's love got to do with it? Yeah, I may love you too, but it's almost like your love is causing someone to change, Scorpio, because they tried to hide it. They tried to live this reckless life, and it was not serving them any good until you had to change the m &F and game, and now this person wants to settle down. That's what I feel like. All right, Spirit, what's Scorpio's secret crush? Who is Scorpio's secret crush in this emperor energy? Clarify the emperor. See, seven of swords, see? Because what this person's realizing that their sneaky ways is going to make them miss out on a good opportunity here, see? From their soulmate. So all this person do, Scorpio, is just watch you and stalk you because they looking at you differently now, see there? They see you as sunshine. They're like this person feels like you're their future here, see? There is a strong connection. See, that's why the Knight of Wands in the reverse. See, because now this person is looking at you like you are long-term material as the Emperor and the Empress because they thought you was everybody else. Ain't that something? So now you got the Two of Cups. Woo, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. That's your soulmate, honey. Spirit, what is Scorpio's secret crush thinking about Scorpio in this Two of Cups energy? You got the Two of Cups twice. Two of Cups, Three of Wands. Like I said, future planning here, waiting. Uh, waiting on your shift to come in. Now this person is waiting on you now. See? And I feel like this person, all this person do is fantasize about you. That's all they do. Seven of Cups, King of Cups, because you are this person's happiness. God dang it. But you had to prove to them that you wasn't no freaking joke. Like I said, Scorpio, your secret crush says that you are 
a game changer, <laughs> okay? So this is your reading. If it resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.